twa, twa, twa. It do not matter. Clip on the ruga, look like a ruler. Okay, so I'm back before the video started. Greatly appreciated where you interact. So please like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, so this video we have the cast. Uh, Zeus revealed the cast last night. Uh, I watched the auditions. Drama after the cast was released. I mean, revealed. <laughs> oh, and some drama from Roly and Diamond and then Tinker, Meatball Mom, Camila. You, you, it's a lot. Okay, so first with the cast, it, it's another football team. It's 18 girls. Like, regular? Regular girls? It's 18 of them. Okay, so you know we got the regulars. The one that, was, that like, of course, is coming back. I don't know. I ain't gonna lie. Some of these girls was not expected. And some of the girls that's not on here was not expecting that either. All right, so boom. First, we got Natalie. Of course. She's, she's never leaving. Um, We got Roly. Knew that shit was going to happen. Been knew that. Scotty, we been knew that. Biggie, I I, I wouldn't have been surprised if she, if she wasn't. You know, wasn't. I didn't. Uh, Tasiki, did not know she was coming back either. Okay, then we got Anna. Did not know she was coming back either. We got Jayla. Knew that was going to happen. And then Diamond and Tinkerbella. That pretty clear. They, they you feel me? They was the breakout stars of the season, in my opinion. Now the thing is, with, with Natalie Diamond, she already apologized, right, for the trolling and shit. But it's like. I wanted to see her versus Natalie, bro. Now, Roly and Diamond. Look, I feel like this beef gonna get burnt out fast, but I do wanna see that fight. I wanna, who would, I, could, I ain't gonna lie, I might get at the Diamond. <laughs> We're gonna talk about that in the video, cause like they was going back and forth a little bit as well. But this beef or this fight, I cannot wait for. It. And I'm, I'm pretty sure that shit is definitely gonna happen. Scotty, we know why Scotty here. Yeah, I'm not mad at it. It's like, we just gotta accept it. You know, it's, <laughs> I think she was a good mediator last season. Also, I don't dislike her. And, you know, she, I feel like Scotty gave a little more last season. I think so. Biggie, um, I don't, <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I'm not the biggest fan of Biggie after this season. I feel like Biggie used the bully word way too often. Situations wasn't even getting bullied. I don't, like, like that shit with uh, DJ Sky and Scotty, that kind of pissed me. It's like, and then you went and got to, it's like, huh? <laughs> And then the things that she complained about, she'll turn around and do. It's, I don't know, Biggie, she pissed me off. I ain't gonna lie, she pissed me off this season. Now, I don't think she's wrong in every situation that happened this season. But some of them, she was definitely wrong in my opinion. Tasiki, this was a surprise. Did not think she was gonna come back, um, because she barely gave anything this season. Uh, But uh, apparently, she beat Diamond at the reunion. Hopefully, it's like, give us something. You don't even have to fight, but it's like, give us something, please. Something. Anna, Anna's back. She's not injured reserve this season. So Anna, you're gonna have to you gonna have to get in there, okay? J.O. Where the hell is y'all did J.O. so dirty, bro? I I just knew they was gonna bring her back at least. That's crazy. Yeah, she could have came back. Jayla is back as well. I don't well, if I'm not mistaken, I don't think Jayla has beef with anybody. Honestly, I think she gotta keep a clean slate. Diamond. Diamond is back. New does she's back. She was like the big star of the show. Uh, of course, she's back. I'm here for it. I feel like Diamond, I feel like uh, her foot is already in the door. We know who you are. And, and honestly, I feel like with this cast, I feel like it's going to be real issues. I feel like it ain't going to be... Uh, well, I hope not. I hope it's not made up beefs and shit like that. And if it is, be good actresses. And don't tell us if it's fake, okay? Just let us believe it's real, okay? But if it is fake, we, we really don't really want it for real. I'm pretty sure y'all could find some real issues to fight about. Tinker. I like Tinker. <laughs> she, she a little dramatic, but I like Tinker. She, she don't really have to do all the extra shit as well. I do think she's a funny person, though. Now, the, the movies. <laughs> I'm also glad Diamond and Tinker, that shit is over. Let's not bring that beat back up. Leave it dead. Y'all y'all better friends. We like y'all as friends, okay? Now we have the new celebrity cast. So I'm guessing they're like there along with the, their cast. They're just celebrity cast, I guess. So we got Jaden and Akbar. Now, Jaden Alexis, as we know, she's a... Uh, what's that man? Blueface. She's Blueface's baby mother. The first baby mother, right? I'm excited, but at the same time, Jaden is like a, well, to me, from what I get, is it's like a I don't give a fuck type of person, not like a I'll fight anybody, she's kind of like, girl, whatever, I don't, I really don't give a fuck type of, from what I got, like, nonchalant kind of, like, for the most part, she don't really feed into, like, the internet bullshit, so I don't know how this is gonna go on the show, <laughs> also, I don't know if, if Jaden could fight, i never seen her fight before, that's gonna be interesting, then we have Akbar, who did this? I don't know. Whoever did it need to be slapped. I know that. I can't stand this lady. I, I, and it's not even on like a hater type of thing. It's more so on like a you talk too damn much, please shut up type of thing. Before this channel, when I used to do a uh, female rap on the other on the other page, Akbar, she just didn't know how to not say nothing. That don't, but that has nothing to do with you. You know? It. Why are you talking? 
uh, hypocritical sometimes, in my opinion. She talked about kids. I don't really like the talking about kids thing. It's, I don't know. I don't know. But I think I think I'm going to do a clean slate. Well, honestly, I need to do it. Like last season, when Asian Doll came, I was not a fan of Asian Doll. Did a, a clean slate. I like her. I like her on the show. I feel like we should be doing clean slates, right? Or no? I mean, if other people got clean slate, shit, and other people, you know what I'm saying? I feel like clean slate, you know? Now, the positives were Agbar. Uh, same thing as negative. She talks too much. <laughs> I don't think she's scared of anybody. Uh, she might piss a couple of girls off because she talked too much. She can't fight, but it, it'll be entertaining. I give her that. I mean, that shit's going to be funny. Her mouth is going to get her in some shit, and I don't think she's like a popping up one or two episodes. They say she's cast. Like, she's not like a an appearance. She said They said she was cast. So she got two months with these girls. <laughs> I also know Agba and Tzatziki are friends or cool or whatever. I think they just linked up if I'm not mistaken. Every time I go on Tzatziki Live, she's saying something to Akbar. Then we have special guest appearances, right? First person is Krishan. Me personally, I'm here for it because uh, Tzatziki is on the show. Yeah, I want I want to see them records. I don't look. I don't want to see them fight. I know everybody want to see them fight. Well, not everybody, but a lot of people. I feel like y'all are like blood ass sisters. Y'all y'all should reconcile in my opinion. I feel like y'all could probably talk it out. I y'all they might not agree. Y'all probably might have to agree to disagree. Uh, y'all don't have to be the best sisters, you know, immediately. But like, I do think they should make up. Also, the little love hate relationship be between Krishan and Natalie, I miss that. Love that. That shit was hilarious. One minute they besties, the next minute Krishan slapping Natalie, or or like they beef in one minute, and next minute Natalie buying uh the baby something. It, <laughs> even when they used to be on live, one minute they laughing with each other, the next minute they throwing shade and arguing. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck is wrong with them, but that shit is hilarious to me. Now the fact that Krishan is back. <laughs> that first of all, Zeus, I don't know. Look, Lemmy, because Lemmy. Wasn't expecting that one, but especially after the whole we was at Diddy party, which is crazy to me. The fact that they admitted that they was at Diddy party, and Krishan was like, Diddy had took him in a room and jacked him up and all. <laughs> now speaking of Krishan, people excited that she's back on the season as an appearance and shit like that, but she on Snapchat saying she's not on Baddies. I know you're like, oh my god, oh my god, Krishan, you on Baddies? No, I'm not on Baddies, baby. But stay tuned. I do have my show coming. Now, I don't know if she's saying, like, just not on the cast. Because they didn't say she was on the cast. She's just an appearance, right? Or she's saying not at all. Child, that's crazy. But anyway, the next special guest is Tommy. Now, <laughs> this one, I'm here for me personally. I like Tommy. I do know she has beef with Roly because they just fought. I don't know if her and Natalie beef still stand or not. And then her and Akbar, I think they still got whatever the hell they got going on. That's not a beef I paid attention to, but I do know they was on Zeus before on a conversation. I don't think they fought on that show. Well, I didn't even watch that actual show. I just seen clips on the internet. Uh, But is that beef burnt out or no? Like, are y'all tired of that beef or y'all excited for that? Because I, I don't know nothing about it for real. Uh, Tommy and Roly, Tommy, they saying that Roly beat you. Now, I know I seen Tommy on live the other day. She was like, it, it wasn't really nothing for real. So, I don't know if she meant, like, security was in it the whole time. I don't know. But if she beat you, Tommy, get your leg back. <laughs> Unless she was in the wrong. If he was in the wrong and Roly, because it had something to do with Bobby. I don't know what the fuck was happening. And apparently Tommy hit Bobby. What the fuck? What? What? I hopefully they got that shit on camera. Well, no, I think he said it wasn't on camera. Damn. Then we have Slim. as from Betty's uh, South, right? She's doing a guest appearance. <laughs> Why? I do know uh, Slim still got fans. Me personally, I'm not one of them. I do also know that majority of the fans feel like, like, okay, so look, Slim and Roly, they friends, then they not friends, then they cool, then, then they ain't cool, then they cool, then they, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of people feel like Roly is in the wrong. They feel like Roly was a bad friend to Slim. Apparently, Roly feel like Slim was being a bad friend, was using her and shit like that, you know? If I'm not mistaken, the last thing Roly and Slim got into Roly she was basically saying she don't really care if white people say the N-word because she said the N, right? And then she compared Gretch to Slim. And she said Slim dad is not black or got a slither of black in him. Some shit like that. And Slim did not like it because it I think it was Father's Day. Her dad passed away and Roly was on line, you know, bringing Slim up. Slim did not like that shit at all. They went back and forth for about two days. It wasn't, you know, they, basically it was just insults, you know? Now, Slim also got a bad beef with Natalie. <laughs> Why? I don't fucking know. I don't know. I don't think anybody knows. Like, I think the last two auditions, Slim got kicked out because, well, I don't know if it was because of this, but, you know, she was 
beef with Natalie. I know that. Also, I don't think she's 100% over her little beef that she had with Krishan a couple years ago. She could be. Now, the audition pigs. Okay, I actually just watched the audition. Like, I'm recording now. It's 2.44. I watched it at like 1 o'clock. Okay. Okay, so first we have Ivory. Right? So if we're doing clean slates, we got to be fair and get the clean slates to everybody. Some people might not know Ivory. Me personally, I know Ivory. Um, this clean slate is going to be pretty hard because you threw pee on Mel. You threw pee. That, like, that shit is disgusting. That's nasty. We don't want that. We don't want to see that. But a clean slate is a clean slate. We got to be fair. I'm going to try not to bring up the pee. Well, I don't know because, like, damn... This, that's P though, bro. That's P. You couldn't like just sneaker, jumped it. Like you threw P. God damn, Ivory. That's disgusting. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. That shit trifling, bro. <sighs> Clean slate or no? Now a lot of people, including myself, did not want Ivory on baddies. I would have put her on Gone Wild. Uh, but you gotta accept it. Okay, she's here. Live with it. Ivory, you be at like a 15. We need to bring it down. That psychopathic stuff. It, we need to calm that down. Okay, please, please. But then, bro, it's like, with well, Ivory, I don't know how much she get paid on that CV. I know it's going to be way less than Zeus. So if she punching everybody, friends and all, slapping everybody, drop kicking everybody and shit like that for the money she get on that CV, what the fuck? Like, it's like, what are you going to do on Zeus? Because I know they're going to pay you. And it's going to be not, it's going to be more than Nada's CV. Damn. She's going to turn into a demon. She's going to, no, no, we don't need it. We don't need it. But like, if she's doing all that for, for 10, 15, 20, it's 20. Imagine if Zeus pay her, what, 30, 40. Like, get, what the? We have a Jasmine Renee. Now, I I didn't see her doing these auditions so far. Um, I don't know much about her. She look pretty, though. Love your scarf, thingy. I love that. Now, we have Bad Dolly. I just seen her on the auditions. Um, Love her. Sorry, love her. Uh, I think Anna, Anna and Meatball wasn't really fucking with her. I was. I was. And we're going to talk about her doing the audition segment. But we're going to, like, get through this, okay? My bad. Also, from what I'm seeing, uh, Bad Dolly. But I feel like, was her name in a song or something? Bad Dolly? Bad. I don't know. I don't know. But I feel like I, I've heard that shit before. It might, they might not have been talking about her. I don't. What song is that? I'm not tripping. Someone said Bad Dolly in a song. Who the fuck was that? Who said that? Okay, I tried to look up Bad Dolly on, on, on Google to see if a song pop up. Shit, this girl is on Now That's TV. Damn. But I, I'm going to find I'm that song. But she, so now Zeus got three Now That's TV girls in one season. You know, y <laughs> that's crazy. She was on Pick a Side. Me personally, I couldn't get past the, the, the first episode. Ain't going to lie. I did hear it was good fights on that show. I ain't watching it though. I'm sorry. I seen a bunch of comments saying they wanted her, but I'm guessing they know her from Now That's TV. I thought everyone wanted her from the auditions because they liked her on the auditions. Not that TV. <laughs> okay, so next we have uh, Big Lex, not the little one. Okay, we're calling you Lex, okay? um, Oh, Bad Dolly, we're calling you Dolly. Jasmine Renee, we're calling you Jasmine, okay? Now, Big Lex, not the little one. We already got a Big Lex. I don't know. Well, I don't know. No, she not on Zeus no more, so technically, yeah, we still calling you Lex. Now, I don't know if I seen her at the auditions yet. I could be. Like, it was a girl that looked like she had these little orange butterflies in her hair. I don't think that's the same girl. It could be. But love your smile. Don't really know you yet, but love your smile. Pretty. We have Yoshi. I don't remember a Yoshi either. She probably didn't come up yet. Is that, why are we getting the cast before we finish the auditions? That don't make sense. You're pretty too, Yoshi. Don't really know you. Love the hair though. Okay, so next we have Emma Aleo or Alayo. I don't. Wait, she kind of look. Oh, no, no, they don't. I thought her and Yoshi looked alike. They don't look alike. I thought they kind of had the same note. I, I don't know. Uh, we're calling you Emma, okay? We have a pretty P. I do. Am I tripping or she look like somebody? Who does she look like? I don't know, but you are pretty, okay? And then we have Summer, none other. Now, this girl is pretty as well. Yeah, she's really pretty. Now, I do know this girl is Anna's friend. I know at the auditions, they said Summer, none other. <laughs> Anna said that was her sister. Uh, I'm pretty. I don't know if that's like her actual sister. Shit, it could be, bro. I don't know if that's her cousin or just like a very good friend. I don't know, but she's pretty as well. I like her. I'm not too mad at this cast. I'm a little shocked. Uh, Sapphire is not back. That's crazy. Wasn't really expecting that. Mariah's not back. That's crazy as well. Wasn't really expecting that. Uh, Asian doll 
is not back. That's crazy. Was not expecting that at all. I could have sworn they was going to bring her ass back. A couple days ago, Asian Doll, she was like, the next season, she going to be dressing real good, you know? So I assumed she was coming back next season. Then cast come out. She's not on the cast. It's like, what the fuck? That, that's not making sense. Also, she put a tweet out saying after the cast was revealed, she put a tweet out saying that she was coming back. It's like, what? <laughs> Look, overall... I'm here for this cast. This cast about to be messy. Natalie, you messy as hell. You so messy. You, ooh. <laughs> this is a very interesting <laughs> group of women. <laughs> like, the, well, I don't know. Because, honestly, most of the girls we already fucking know. Right? But I'm, I'm pretty excited for these new girls. That is going to be something. I feel like we should do clean slates all around. You know what I'm saying? I, that's my opinion. Where the fuck is Wet Wet? Where's Wet Wet? I'm, not, I'm literally not understanding where is Wet Wet. It's like, why, so why is it in your bio? Are you just manifesting or something? Like, why would, you, they really gave our hopes up, bro. And, and like, Natalie, you knew we wanted wet, wet. You acknowledged that we wanted wet, wet, what, two, three times? And y'all still there put her on the cast? Weird. That shit weird. I really do hope Zeus It's like, the whole, we only see footage when y'all meet up. Can y'all not do, can y'all just go in the house and record shit? It's, I just hate the meetups. I hate the meetups. We only see y'all when y'all going out, meeting up together to eat dinner or having a house meeting. Or y'all doing an activity. We don't want it. We want y'all in the house. Like, this is why people like Baddies West, because y'all was just in the house. Yeah. Then y'all came with the Baddies East, and it's just meetups. We don't know. Well, no, no, we don't want it. We don't want it. But anyways, um, like I said, today I watched the auditions, and I found some things interesting, some things irritated me. We're going to start, okay? Okay, so first of all, the girl Harmony, the one that was, like, stalking. <laughs> Y'all remember her? She was on the show. I mean, on this episode. I think Anna hit her, and then, like, security broke it up. I do know. I Anna, Anna said they jumped her outside after or tag-teamed her or something after the auditions. I don't know if it's on camera or not. Uh, me, boss, she got out the car, y'all, as she's walking... The pants, is, the pants is gone. It's like, it's not on her ass no more. How did that happen? I don't know. And like, she didn't pull them back up. Like, she just, do you not feel your pants falling down? My bad, the Harmony girl that Honor was trying to fight, Mariah was too. I was like, okay, y'all really bounced back from that shit, okay. Uh, Tzatziki hair, loved it. It's not tea, I just liked her hair. Uh, Tinka, I love Tinka come up. From her being at the auditions last season to this season, I just love that. I'm sorry, I love it. The very first girl, she came in there, no talking, did a split, got a ticket. <laughs> that shit was hilarious. Scotty, she was drunk. And I'm pretty sure a lot of the girls was drunk, but Scotty was drunk. I look down, look up. Jayla and Scotty is, is dancing, and Scotty doing a kickflip. I don't know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> oh, somebody punched the wrong girl that they were supposed to be punched. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? Dolly. Okay, so this was like Dolly episode. I mean, I'm, I'm glad Dolly's on the cast, bro, because she was like the star of this audition, well, this episode, um, so here's the thing, didn't like her at first, like, in the very beginning, did not like her, because the girl, she said, she, well, she was taking off her shoes, and ended up sitting down to take her heels off, right, Dolly snuck her while she was sitting down, and it's kind of like, after, after she snuck her, didn't like her, like, that shit was weird, it was giving Diamond and Tinka all over again, but she did let the girl get her head up, she ended up winning again, but, yeah, no, that I will say, she did give the girl her head up, and it's like, me seeing her fight this girl head up, you didn't even have to sneak her, I feel like you probably was going to win regardless. You didn't even have to do that. But then, Dolly, she started giving everybody their head up. Wasn't scared of nobody. She's beating literally everybody. Now, Anna and Meatball, they didn't like that uh, Dolly snuck the girl. Me personally, I ain't like that shit either, right? But she ended up giving her head up. And everybody else, they head up, right? And then it was one girl that Dolly wasn't fighting, like, whatsoever. She, I don't know, just the fight wasn't with this girl. But she wanted to fight. And, and Sapphire stopped and she like, what you doing? And the girl was like, I want to get in the paint too. For no reason, mind you. She fought because she wanted to. It was no beef, right? So the girl fight Dolly. Dolly beat her too. <laughs> <laughs> right now but Anna and me ball they mad because apparently dolly got rings on i was like and how many times have we seen fights on baddies where girls had rings on it was like they was really mad that this dolly girl had rings on i was like i thought we moved past this shit i thought y'all didn't care about rings no more you know because me ball you had a knife a fucking knife did you forget that you threw a chair and y'all mad she got rings on Anna, you wrapped the chain around your hand and punched and they let you and you mad this girl got rings on she fired five girls you mad she got a ring on what like y'all can have y'all weapons but the girl that's fighting five four or five girls she can't have a ring you can wrap a chain and you can have a, a fucking knife throw a chair but y'all draw the line at rings <laughs> so 
what? Hey, mind you, the weapons y'all had, Zeus let it happen. They allowed y'all to do that. I'm pretty sure someone saw you wrap that chain around your head. Me, boy, the fact that you had enough time to, to throw a chair, Zeus allowed you to have a knife on multiple occasions and actually sent the girl home that you was threatening. It's like, no, no, we're not doing that. And on top of that, the girl didn't even want to fight the other girl with the little orange red shit. She, that girl wanted to fight. Dolly wasn't even about to fight her. She was about to fight another girl. Meepo said, okay, you want to fight? Y'all two fight. And Dolly did. She did. And she won. So I was like, what's the problem? I like Dolly. Now, the sneak thing I don't agree with, right? I don't agree with it. But then we accept Diamond after Diamond snuck Tinker. How many people got snuck last season? Come on. Like, come on. Oh, oh, somebody snuck Mariah. I was like, what the fuck? Uh, hey, Mariah got her lick back on the next episode. I know that's right, Mariah. I, yeah. Oh, also, the way Mariah was ready to fight for Honor, Honor was running up on that girl for Mariah. The two smallest girls <laughs> ready to fight everybody. <laughs> other than that, it was a bunch of girls at the auditions fighting each other. Me personally, don't really give a fuck. I skipped past it. Wait, hold on, because I know I seen one girl, her face was scratched up bad. It's like, did the other girl swing? Or, like, you not Wolverine? Why? Like, that lady face was, what the fuck? <laughs> It was like seven scratches, long ass scratches too. I don't know, that shit was weird. It's like you was trying to dig in her skin or something. Okay, so lastly, we're talking about the drama that happened in like, I think, what, the past two days, right? Uh, starting with Roly and Diamond, okay? <laughs> so, for, well, we know it started because, you know, Diamond, she felt some type of way about them not voting her to get a chain. Roly was like, I was never voting you to begin with all you. So, this is like a picked up with like where we left off with them two. And it's not really much, what kind of, I don't know. But I know this. Uh, Roly, she posted this. So, she posted. Diamond on some man in the ocean. I don't know. Look, if I'm supposed to know this, I'm sorry, but I don't know what the fuck that is. But she said, new star of Friday the 13th. Oh, is this Friday the 13th? I didn't watch that movie. She said, only a face a mother could love. Then Diamond, she posted Roly when she was on Jerry Springer and she was like swimming in the Alfredo sauce with the noodles and shit like that. <sighs> okay. She also posted a picture of uh, someone edit her to be precious from the movie. You know, I, I know that movie. Now, Diamond, she also said some things as well. She said, why people want to play with me when I'm trying to change my life? I don't know. Like, why are you trying to play with me when I'm trying to heal? And it's like, Diamond, cut the crap. Cut the crap. You already said that y'all love the character I play, so fuck it. We know what you about to be on this season doing. Girl, we know. Once Roly said Diamond wasn't getting the chain, all she do was troll, it was game time. That activated Diamond, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's about to be some bullshit, bro. You know, Diamond, she said how she felt about not getting the chain. Roly, she said how she felt about Diamond not getting the chain. They ain't really fucking with each other. So, Tink, not Tinker. Why did I say Tinker? I don't know. But Diamond, she was like, uh, don't play with me, go play with your kids. Oh, yeah, that's Tinker's song. She was, Diamond was like, don't play with me, go play with your kids. The one that you be smoking with. Now Guys, I'm really trying to change. <laughs> I'm really trying to, like, be a better person. But it's like, why would you want to play with me? Just because I'm trying to change don't mean play with me. Like, I ain't all the way healed yet. Okay? What um, Tinka said? Bitch, don't play with me. Go play with your kids, dummy. The kids that you be smoking with. And, yeah, go play with them. Don't play with me. Please. Wait, now, if you don't know what Diamond is talking about, right? The son, I think? I think the son had posted a video of him and Rolly. They was dancing in the mirror while he was smoking. People feel like... Roly is a bad mother for allowing him to smoke. Roly, she was like, basic. Okay, so basically, what Roly is saying, well, I think this is what she's trying to say. He was trying to say like he's going to smoke anyway. So if I'm if I'm controlling his setting and who he's smoking with and shit like that, he's more safer here. You know, I don't I don't know if y'all agree with what she was saying or not. It was but it was a whole thing, especially on Twitter. It was a whole thing. I don't think we had to bring up the kid in this argument. That she was body chain. We got to start leaving kids out of the conversation. Uh, I think the boy was about 16. Uh, me personally, I can see where people find it weird. I also can see Roly explanation. It ain't my kid, though. And I'm not a mom, so I don't I don't really know. Now, after the cast was dropped, right, Roly, she went and said, when I tell you I'm going to reopen that lip for speaking on my child, y'all, <laughs> that's a fight I really cannot wait to see. Now, when Roly said that, um, Diamond, she said she feel like the girls always make another fake reason on why they want to fight her. Like, she said the son, uh, mentioning Roly's son is not the real reason why Roly want to fight her. She feel like Roly been wanting to fight her. Why do the girls always try to make, like, this other fake reason why they want to, like, fight me? It's so funny. They be like, oh, yeah, I'm going to fight you because you said this. It's like, come on, Roly. Like, we all saw that you didn't like me from the, from the last dinner. From the from the moment you got up and snatched the chain and did the 
did I waddled over into a meatball like girl we seen that you didn't like me the whole world saw that you didn't like me you don't gotta make these excuses oh I'm doing this because of this no babe you're doing this because you're a hater because you don't like me because I'm everything that you ever wanted to be in life because I woke up like this and you had to go to sleep 30 times to look like that and you still don't look like this like, I get it. You know what I'm saying? You thought you did your biggest one giving the chain to Meatball. Bitch. You, 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 you want to get the chain to Meatball so bad, Mama Meatloaf. Meatloaf and Meatball. That's what y'all wanted. Y'all thought y'all was like a little tag team. Meatloaf and Meatball. No, babe. That wasn't it. You did your smallest one. The smallest one you could possibly do. Because that you can't go do nothing else small. <laughs> That's the only smallest thing you could have done. And you thought you ripped that shit. You thought you was doing your ah! Uh, give the chain, hoo 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 Browser, girl, like why you hate me? We ain't had no beef. We ain't had no problem. We ain't had nothing going on. All of a sudden, you team meatball and meatloaf. Like, girl, get out of my face. You been didn't like me. You been want to fight me. You are a hater. You're looking for a moment. You're looking for. a storyline you're looking for like girl whatever all right i'm gonna give it to you you want to be a big ass old bitch i'm gonna be a mother what's the moment with the <laughs> with the red flag <sighs> yeah um i don't know if she been wanted to fight you it was clear she didn't like you i don't know if she been wanted to fight you but like mentioning someone's kid especially while they in the middle of like Defending themselves to the internet about their kid, maybe, yeah, maybe she really do feel some type of way of you do saying that. Now, she probably really did been wanting to fight you, and this is just, you know, her reason to want to fight you. Because, like, her not liking Diamond, uh, well, fighting for that, it, didn't, it wouldn't really make sense, so this might be, like, her reason. But it's like, Diamond, you gotta stop mentioning kids. You have to stop mentioning kids, though, like, because those are real reasons why people would want to fight you. You could, now, what Diamond said could absolutely be right, though. I don't know. Now, also, after the cast reveal, some of the baddies, they, you know, kind of in their feelings, kind of not really fucking with it, kind of feel like this weird stuff happening, okay? So, first, we got J.O. J.O. said, crazy, no hit squad, no one. We've been played again after all this PTSD shaking my head. This industry-ish is crazy. We're going to win regardless, ladies. Nunu, Gretch, Kiva, Heaven, Wendali, yeah. Uh, I know people wanted Nunu back. I know people wanted Gretch back. I don't, did people want Kiva back? I don't know. I know for a fact people want to have a marina back. And I ain't gonna lie, I don't even remember when Dolly. I don't I don't remember her at all. I know I know the name. I remember the name, but her on the screen, I don't remember. Was she? I, I really don't remember. Callie, she said something as well. I don't really think it's bad. She said baddies was was really never for me. I'm thankful for the opportunity to see the hype, but in real life, I'm bigger than the baddies. That's why I wanted HBIC and not a baddies chain. It's time for other things. Thank you, Zeus Network, and let me for the opportunity. Good luck to the future cast. Baddie, baddie, shot o'clock. That's a wrap for me. Let's get it done the K way. Mm, it was a little shady. It wasn't really that bad. I think the bigger than baddies thing. Well, but I don't know. I don't. She probably didn't mean it in like a terrible way. She, I, I doubt it. I highly doubt it. Like she probably means she want more for herself than you know just fighting on TV. Maybe. Natalie, she didn't really fuck with it though. She was like, it's crazy that this is the second girl since yesterday to say thank you and not mention me. And this is why you're not the HBIC. But good luck. Uh, it's always love. Mwah. Okay. So, Natalie, she's mad that Kylie didn't say, thank you, Lemmy, and thank you, Natalie, for this opportunity, basically. And lastly, we have Nunu. She made a couple of tweets about uh not being on this season as well, okay? So, first she said, one of the last two replacements who made it, how neither me or Kiva on that Midwest cast. Do y'all feel like Nunu and Kiva should uh be on this cast because, like, they were the last two replacements. They came in, shook it up, and, like, shit like that. She said, now imagine if I was on the full season. I would have definitely been one of the breakout stars for that season. She also said, uh, I was one of the most talked about replacements. My sounds are going viral on TikTok. I'm constantly on the blogs. Uh, just like I was on the main cast, I brought the looks and personality and was barely even shown. Make it make sense. She said, not one reserve. Like, huh? Didn't get a full opportunity from how they played in our faces for the baddies Caribbean. I just knew they were going to right the wrong and they didn't. That's crazy. Do y'all feel like the, what they, what's they called? The hit squad was done wrong for not uh, being on this cast or like not even as replacements or reserved or anything. Okay, so then we have Tinker and Camila. 
random ass parrot, but okay, right? Okay, so someone, they made a post. Well, a, a T-page, I think. They made a post. And they said, I don't care what y'all say. Tinker gives very much actress. Very much one, two, three scene. Very much cinema, right? And then Camila, she was like, she's definitely acting. I never saw any tears. Okay, so, um, with Tinker, do I feel like it gave cinema? Yeah. <laughs> but, like, not, like, acting. Like, I don't think, like, I think the situ this situation with them was very much real. I would not say cinema. It's like she's very dramatic and, like, uh, like, like, animated, you know? I do think she really feel how she feel, though. I don't think that's fake. I'm sorry. I don't think it's fake. Now, Camila, she feel like Tinker was acting. She said she didn't see tears on, uh, Tinker's face. Now, Tinker... She claps back at Camila. She said, I normally respect my elders, but what the F is you want? Now it's getting creepy. I've been with your mind since the beginning of time. And let's be clear, I don't know you and you definitely don't know me. You're a hater. Oh, you're either a, a hater or you want to... Okay. Um, just ask you old hag. Well, I like Tinker. I don't care. Is she dramatic? Yeah, but I still like her. Tinker said, girl, I'm getting paid and you somewhere on my D. Shouldn't you be cooking and cleaning or losing that stomach? I don't even know you, auntie. The F worry about a gym girl. You worried about me. Said, this weird girl been speaking on me since she seen me. Why are you a hater? It's so not attractive like ew. The F you on Krabby Patty. Shoot, shoot. What? Y'all gonna stop playing now. I had a very tough day and it's up for whoever. Leave me alone. I don't bother nobody. Lay off me or just support or just support like you can't be a D-eater and a fan. Pick one. Now, this is where Meebo Mom comes in. She basically agrees with what Camila says. So Meebo Mom says, I'm glad someone see it. Damn, like this is crazy. Then she said she couldn't wait for a, pla a platform to show off and show out on Meebo. And brainwash the shit out of the people. I know the real. We're brainwashed? They think we what? Then Tinker responded to me, but mom, she said, here you go about to lie. What happened to staying out of it? Want to be on baddie so bad. I'm tired of y'all, man. Like, for real. Stay out of it like my mom is. Because you'll, you'll know where we at if we want to get parents involved. No offense. Sorry if you're offended. Now, Tinker, me both said your mom being comments and shit like that, too, after she said y'all need to reconcile and stuff. Like, I don't know. It sounds like y'all mom's doing the same thing, bruh. Now, Camila, she's not responding to Tink, right? She said, Dirty Bella mad at my comment. I see. What? <laughs> Camila, did you want her to be happy to see it? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Uh, they don't have nothing to say to these blogs, but always come for me and my motherhood. My stomach got you bad built girls bothered. Go find some lightning cream for them black ass elbows and knees you got. Okay, so this is kind of like the, uh, that never ending, they can say whatever they want to, well, and as they should, they can't say whatever the hell they want. But y'all know that uh, argument where like public figures speak on stuff? And then, like, be mad that people are responding to the public figure, even though everyone else said their opinion. Why y'all acting like this public figure can't say their opinion? You know, that. Y'all know that argument? I feel like everyone has their right to say whatever the fuck they want to say. You know, this is America, okay? Um, But I do think you being a public figure, you should know you're going to get opinions on what you said. You're going to get opinions on your opinion, you know? Like, come on. Yeah. And then it's like, come on, like, you know you're not a regular person. You're one of the baddies, you know what I'm saying? So, of course, she was going to respond to you. Y'all in the same little world, you know? Now, Camila, she did her tweets as well, like, uh, Tink did. She said, girl, you can never be on my level, not even hanging with Zeus, okay? Then she was like, oh, hey, you look older than me and my mother. Body sloppy as hell. Don't be mad at a comment, boo. You on TV, that's what you signed up for. Don't be salty. Then come for me as a mother, as a mother body, Girl, you weak. Like, that's what I mean. You saying she can't be mad because that's what she signed up for. That's what you signed up for, too. You're a public figure as well. <laughs> I was like, what? Y'all in the same boat. Of course you gonna say something to you, bruh. She said, now let me go back to my motherly duties because you girls could never. All right? Now, me personally, I don't like when people come for Camila stomach, bro. She had kids. Uh, Tinker, I don't think Tinker body sloppy. I like Tinker body. She, she look good to me. Camila said, uh... I'm too cool, too fly. Y'all always mad when Camila speak. Dummies, I'm commenting like the rest of the folks. Fusan, Isaiah. Fusan, Isaiah speak and y'all girls be on their D's. I speak and y'all girls be mad. Oh, well, well, I feel like it's because you're a baddie as well. And you just call, it's like, how, you can't really be, I don't know. I don't know. I don't, Camila, you can't be mad that she don't like your comment. Camila said, imagine coming for me and you 50 shades of black, pick a side. A face card never declines, and that's what I'll make up. So please don't ever come for me. I'll be old and blessed and highly favored. You should go to an acting school. It should be, it would be a great idea. Someone posted this, uh, comparing Tinker to Beetlejuice. Isn't this Beetlejuice? If it's not, I'm sorry. And Camila was like, I don't play with dead people. Camila said, the nerve of the girls that really be trying to come for me when I really just look at, 
at the my whole get down like the nerve okay oh uh, she said better be lucky you got an opportunity because you ain't getting one anywhere else you better enjoy it well she back from next season bro now someone said i be feeling like you just want to join the show at this point and then camila said want to join i did and declined the next shows they offer definitely not press just comment like the rest and they get mad you decline it well yeah because she's not on the show but remember when she was like she just met lemmy or something like that I wonder why she declined it, bro. She was just like, she she met up with Lenny or ran into Lenny and stuff, and they got stuff coming and shit. Like, why you decline it? Well, she got, I don't know. I don't. Camila said, y'all girls make one good check and forget you really look like this on a regular. You can't compare to me, sis, so just don't. I'll take a belly every day for my kids than to wake up with this look. Someone said, hmm, girl, I don't know. It's like you beefing with people you wasn't even on the show with. Camila said, I made a comment. Ain't no beef. Uh, they the, they with the ones, what? They the ones that's pressing mad. What's the difference of my comment I made on someone post? Y'all be, y'all be sounding kind of slow. So then someone posted the fight Camila had with Roly at the reunion. They said, wish that same energy was brought here instead of her flailing on the ground like a cockroach. Camila said, no hands connected. Left untouched, but sat on absolute, absolutely. What else she was supposed to do but eat and sit down? See, Camila, you should have took the offer because you be talking shit. <laughs> Did his connect with Roly and Camila fight? I'm going to have to go back and see that. I'm trying hopefully I can find that video. Oh, anyway, I'm over this, but we still got stuff to read. Now, Tinker, she was like, top of the morning. Uh, I'm on you old girls' minds. Anyway, have a blessed day, everybody, right? So then Camila was like, since... Since when was talking about natural mother bodies of flex when your face is 15 different shades of melanin? Looking like spotty daddy uh, is always so funny to me because news flash her body out of her pocket to be so young. Now, Mebo mom said once again she threatened me and now I'm scared for my life. She also said I watch the show like everyone else. If I gotta stop commenting, then everyone should stop. Uh, it's a show I've been watching for years. I don't care if my child on it or not. And I'm not a baddie. I'm a boss mom. But like I said, Mebo said Tink mom be uh, commenting on shit too. I don't know who Tink mom is or what. Uh, this shit messy. That ain't, cause uh, aren't all of y'all in like a five block radius? What is wrong with y'all? Meepo Mom also posted these messages, I'm assuming, from Tank. Okay, the message says, why y'all think Meepo Instagram pages keep getting taken down? You will never win against me, let it go. <laughs> Bro, if Tank is the reason Meepo keep losing her pages, that is crazy. But then the mom said, why are you still texting me with your jealous ass? Damn, uh, you just told on yourself, wow. Okay, right. Now Tinka also said to me, Bo Mom, uh, and she and she embarrassed you several times and who you call. Come on, Lo oh, is she Lois? <laughs> is she I didn't know that. Um she said, Come on, Lois, I see where she gets it from. You are a part of the problem. You condone this behavior. It's so sad because she turned around and embarrassed you, then you'll be up uh, you and then you be upset. Like show her different as a parent. Don't you think it's time? One minute you want to be a mommy, next member you want to be a cast member. This is crazy, mom. Please get her. Oh, Oh, is that her mom? Only one time? To Wait, child. Okay, that was a lot. I feel like this is a long ass video. That okay. Um, look, y'all. If y'all found this video interesting, and I hope you did, please like, comment, subscribe, share, turn your post notifications on. Thank you.